Hey guys, my name is Isabella and welcome to my ASMR channel. So before we get into today's video, I just want to remind everyone about a couple of things. First, I have a Patreon where for $3 a month, you can get four extra ASMR videos each and every month. I also have an OF where right now, if you join, you can get 40% off of your first month along with a free gift. So if that's something you might be interested in, you can use the link, tree link, down below in my description box. Um, also, using that same link, tree link, you'll find a link to my Wizio, where I make all of my custom ASMR videos, and a link to my Instagram if you'd like to follow me over there. Last but not least, remember to subscribe to my channel if you would like, and like this video as well. But now let's get into today's roleplay. So, what are you in trouble for? I've never seen you in detention, and I'm in detention all the time. <laughs> like, literally all the time. It's ridiculous. What have I not gotten in trouble for? Skipping class, talking back to my teachers, um, late homework dress code violations, um, oh, talking too loudly in the library after the librarian kept telling me to be quiet, but I really had to tell my friend this crazy story, so she just like didn't get it. And I said, I was like, I will be quiet after I finish my story, thank you, but apparently that was talking back. Anyway, why are you here? Oh wow. That's pretty bad. Why would you do that? But like also, very impressive. <laughs> no, literally like they say detention is just like hands on your desk. No talking, no doing anything, but the detention proctor is like never actually here. He's like always leaving to go talk to his girlfriend. Yeah, oh, I mean I've been in here long enough that I'm on pretty good terms with him, so he's like told me his life story at this point. His girlfriend's a teacher at a different school, so she always calls him at the end of the day after she finishes classes for the day, and like no one comes in to check on us, so he's just like always saying, everyone like, honor system, don't act up, don't do anything, it's gonna get him in trouble, and then he like goes outside in the hall, and he just talks mushy to her for like an hour. I've like listened, put my ear up to the door a few times. It's hilarious the stuff he says. Anyway, tell me more about this uh, prank gone wrong. I mean, based on what you just told me, what do you have like at least a month? Three? Ooh. Yeah, now I figured. I'm surprised they didn't suspend you for that. Gotcha. Yeah, no, they do that. I know this principal doesn't think suspension is an actual punishment because it's, they say if you have like your parents both work so you'll be home alone they're like it's a reward because you'll just stay home and like hang out and have fun all day yeah it's not like you're missing out hanging with your friends it's like hello i can just text them and they're probably jealous that i don't have to sit in boring history class and homeroom all day That's 
so funny though. I'm like very impressed and it's difficult to impress me because I've, well, done so many bad things at this school. Can't wait for college. No one cares in college what you do. Is this your pen? <sighs> like, no one cares. Like, everyone is just busy doing their own thing. You can get away with so much more. Here, it's like all eyes on you 24-7. You misbehave in the slightest. You get detention. It's like ridiculous. Where were you um, going for college? You're a senior, right? I'm a junior. One more year after this. I cannot wait to get out of here. Oh, wow. It's a hard school to get into. You must be smart. Mm hmm Sounds like it. Here's your pen back. Yeah, I was just kind of fidgeting with it. It's like there's nothing else to do in here. I get so bored. I mean, I guess that's the point. But it doesn't make me, like, not want to act up. It just makes me bored. What would you be doing if you weren't in detention right now? Really? Mm. I don't know. I. D. Okay. I spent so much time in here that I'm like, what did I even do before? I was constantly getting in trouble. Probably go home. H. E and I don't know, make myself a snack, watch TV, and then maybe do my homework. H W homework. <sighs> do you have a girlfriend? Do you want to play a game? I'm going to spell a word, and you can guess what I'm spelling, okay? I'll try to go easy first. Or maybe do I have to do it this way? Dog. Uh-huh. Good job. What about... Let me try to do it again. No. Mm-hmm. 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 My bracelet. I wore it to the Taylor Swift concert. This one says lover. I know, right? I have so many others. Mm -hmm. spelled kiss? What do you think I want to kiss you or something? Maybe I do. That would get me another detention for sure. 
kissing and detention. I don't think that's allowed, but at the same time, there's no one here to witness it. Hmm. I'll think about it. You said you don't have a girlfriend, and there's not much else to do in here. But it have to be a secret. Mm. Unless you want me to get another detention, so I have to spend another day in here with you. Um. I have detention all next week, and then after that, I think I'm in the clear, but something usually happens in the meantime to keep me here. Oh well. So, should we see how bad my luck is? See if Mr. Proctor locks in right as we're about to... Oh, I'm ready whenever you are. Mm hmm Okay. That was, that was good. What do you think? Why, thank you. I'm a little disappointed we didn't get caught, though. I mean, that was the thrilling part. No offense. Kissing you was nice, too, but I was hoping for a level of danger. You know? Mm. I don't know. Keep looking at my bracelet. Are you jealous? Do you want one? I'll make you a bracelet. I have so many leftover beads from the concert. Should we do one more? make detention a little more interesting today. I mean, I didn't even feel the desire once to go eavesdrop, eavesdrop on all the mushy, I love you, no I love you more talk that's going on in the hallway right now. Usually that's my only source of entertainment, but you are a very good distraction. Not a bad way to spend an hour after school. I might have to get more detention just to spend time with you. 
think about it. I have a lot of things I know I could do. Trust me, I'm a pro at this by now. You'd think I'd be better at getting away with things. Hmm. Maybe I enjoy getting caught. I don't know. Well. Tell me a secret about you. And I won't tell anyone. Like. Is this prank gone wrong the only one you've ever done or is this just the first time you've gotten away you haven't gotten away with it mm hmm I see you should involve me next time I mean I know I tend to get in trouble a lot, but I'm really, I think, just not that careful. I think if I really wanted to be careful, I could come up with a really good prank and help you get away with it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm here if you decide you want to assistant next time. Be more than happy. Maybe we could vandalize the school a little bit. Just a thought. We could spray paint the principal's car. Is that going too far? What about put silly string all over it? Mm hmm. I like that one. We'd have to buy a lot of silly string. My parents give me a pretty generous allowance, so that shouldn't be a problem. Okay. I think you're my new partner in crime. <laughs> I'm very, very glad you got caught. Otherwise, we might not have been able to form this alliance. Thank you all for watching. I'd like to take a moment to give a special 